this is gonna be kind of weird. Ooh. Oh, that did like nothing? I know it was only one auto water orb, but Hopefully they'll all get blitzed by the Hydra, is really what I'm hoping for. I might have enough stamina to even just block the Hydra. Oh, I can easily block the- oh, you know what, never mind. It'll just be a slow fight. And I might have to somehow cheese the last head. So back off. Back off, you two. You three, you four all coming this way. Oh, that head's gonna be a pain. The problem is, you know there's one head that is very awkward about hitting, right? You know that head. That one is going to be an actual just headache to kill. This fight will take longer than Gwendolyn. Yes. No, uh, yes. Oswald. Yes. Ooh, what? Have I taken that many hits on this run? Wow. I would love for these golems to die. Yeah, it's Oswald of Kareem. Leonidas knows. Oh, no. Thank you. Kill the last one now. Is the last one just loot? No, it's not. Though that's from the start of the game. I don't know how much I've repaired my gear, but that's not bad. Please don't do a jump attack. Thank you. There we go. Oh, hot dogs. Ah, oh, and that head is one hit at a time. Oh, God. <laughs> Forever alone guy who wanted a hug. Amazing. What a great name for such a good character. <laughs> oh, God. Hey, I got two hits on that head. At least you can see the damage I've done already. Wait, does this, does this one have like 2,600 life, or is it 1,600 life? Might only be 1,600. <laughs> That's amazing. Thank you very much. I might... What's the size of that image? The resolution? I could set that as the, uh, I was gonna say I could set that as the, uh, as the thumbnail for this video. Because <laughs> technically I punched, like, wait, is Priscilla? No, I was gonna say I punched two gods to death, but I don't think Priscilla's counted as a god. Goddess. But still. I think they have 1600 health, not 2600. Oh god. They almost just dragged me into the water there. How did I not get hit there? Oh. Ugh. At least they do, like, scratch damage. They really aren't deadly. Why did I do that? Don't ever go for a jump attack. Oh god, that one almost hit me. Hey, five hits, that's good. I'm still not quite sure how I'm going to take out the last head. Because that one is going to be a real pain. Thank you. I will gladly use that as the, uh, as the thumbnail for this video. I bet you, I bet you could have totally heard that, uh, DM, too. <laughs> Did 
Did I miss with my fist there? No, I don't think I actually missed. It just didn't make a noise. What? No! Game! Why? <laughs> see what I mean by hitting X? Like, I'm not even... I'm barely... I know you can't see my controller, but I'm barely moving it when that happens. I'm just gonna go ahead and heal. I think I've done... I think I'm at a good pace for them at least until the last head, but the last head I can't even really take damage on. Sweet. It looks so good. I like it. Look at how that's missing me too. Isn't that weird? Okay, how do you turn that off? I could have sworn there was no way to turn off motion controls. Ooh, don't do that. I might have to check that out. I could have sworn I looked through the, the settings before, though. Yeah, I just did that because it was an extra hit. Two damage is two damage. Hmm, I'll have to look into that because I could have sworn you couldn't. I hate it, and it's been in like every Dark Souls game. Well, it wasn't in Dark Souls 2, was it? Which is funny. They did something right in Dark Souls 2. Oh boy. No. I mean, Dark Souls 2 does plenty good, but also... As you know by my opinion, it does a lot of bad. And it's very likely. I could have just overlooked it. I know you can for the for the switch. You can at least shut off. Well, I, I know I shut off vibration. So I can't stand vibration, which is really weird. I know, but I don't like it. Ah, I haven't even broken a head. This is crazy. This is great. Three, four. Ah, only like three hits. Hmm. And the best part about this is, even if I decided I didn't want to do this fist only, I don't have any alternate, so I'd have to restart this fight if I didn't do it fist only. That's actually the first time getting hit by one of the heads, not blocking. Can I block this? Wow, I can. Okay. Only it pushed me back far enough that it just set them up for another one. Whatever. I probably shouldn't block it if it's coming towards me, though, like that. Because I have a feeling it could knock me into the water or something. At the very least, I'll use it as a thumbnail for my actual Gwendolyn kill, if I speed it up or if I just make it into a video. Also, I think if and when I kill the, the Hydra, I'm going to keep it, I'm actually going to also clip it, because while it might not seem too impressive, I'd say it's an impressive kill. I thought it was 76 HP per head, by the way, so it shouldn't be too many more until I break off at least one of them. On this one, at least. The other one has, like, 200-something per head or something, I think. I'm not killing the other Hydra, by the way. I doubt I'll ever really go to Ash Lake, for that matter. How? Look at this. Look at how much damage he's taken, even. Jesus. This shield is impressive at plus nine. I mean, it helps that I have a lot of stamina, but like... Come on. Wouldn't it be crazy if you just couldn't knock off the heads if you do too low of damage? I don't think... I mean, I know that's not the case, but... Actually, that'd be really good. One of them has to be almost off, though. Like this one or something, right? Oh, 
Nope, not what I wanted. Run. <laughs> I keep slightly turning it into the way of that attack. It's kind of funny. There we go. Have I not hit that head more than like 20 times? I would have sworn I had. And I, I could, maybe it isn't 76 health per head or something, but uh, maybe I'll just pull this up real quick. I uh, okay. Uh, oh no, I should probably look at the Hydra. Ah, it is 2,500 health. And, oh, okay, it's 264. I was totally off. Whatever. I don't know where I was getting my numbers from. Maybe I, I probably just pulled them out of thin air. Like, 76 doesn't even add up to, like, 1,600. I don't know what I was thinking. I'm going crazy, I guess. This one's getting close, though, at least, I think. Hmm. I'll get worried once I start knocking off heads, and then I'm stuck with the weak ones. Or, not the weak ones, but the bad aiming ones. If I, like, I mean, I'm kind of consistently landing 20, 16 to 20 damage, so it shouldn't, it shouldn't be more than, like, uh, 30 cycles. Even that's... Ah, I keep doing that. It's definitely dying faster than I am, at least. That's for sure. If only I didn't spam water. And the hitbox on that water is real iffy. That's why you try to run the other direction. That's why you run this way when avoiding the water, because they shoot towards... Well, they just shoot inward and... Yeah, whatever. Why did I roll? It didn't get me any more damage. It's like free damage for them, but it's like not much free damage anyways. Hey! Oh, hey, wait, that's one head down. Eesh. Or like uh, a third of the way there or something. This head, there's like, there's one other head that I've also been hitting. I don't know which one it is, but... I know I wasn't exclusively hitting that one head. Though at this rate, it looks like I'm ahead of... Like one, two, three, four, five, six. There's still six heads. How have I only just now taken off one of them? That was good. Four hits total. Good. Hey, I still got a hit. Okay, sweet. Is it easy? Is it any easier to deal with a hydra if you run to the other side of the lake? You think? I have this feeling that the answer is no. <laughs> I don't know though. Yeah, 
Hey, three hits. I don't even. Hey, I still hit one. I'm like a third of the way through. Yeah, I'd say so. Alright, I could have gotten another hit in, I think. Maybe. Maybe. That head scares me. Basically, they could have actually made this fight better by just having the heads change patterns every time one's broken off. How did that hit me? Through my shield. I'm very confused. Plus, it would have made for a more dynamic fight anyways. It would have just been more enjoyable. Because the way that it is, that head swoops like that because it's cutting between so many others. Hmm. I don't know. Actually, now that I think about it, if I'm going for all the heads, there aren't a... I'm gonna cut off... I'd have to cut off all the heads before actually uh, dealing enough damage to kill it. So... I should break all... I should be uh, cutting off all the heads, it seems by the end of this. Hmm. That's not good. That means I have to deal with that one. I need to reposition. I hate the way that this works. Because the heads don't really stay centered. Like, I'm really tempted to run around the lake, but it there's like no way it's better, right? Not, at least maybe if I had the rusted iron ring, but I don't. Hey, oh hey, two heads down, okay. That one was really close, I didn't realize. Ugh. Working on, where was, why was there dust behind that one? Or behind me? I really don't like that that, uh, water pulse. Hmm. You know, it's really interesting, by the way, that they actually had, like, unique symbols for every piece of armor. Or, er, I think it's every piece of armor has a unique symbol for being at risk. I don't know if it applies to weapons, but even if it doesn't, it's still crazy. That one, this one's got to be close to coming off, too, I think. Ugh. Also, the water's ledge is like the water's edge is like really close on this side. Very unfortunate. Wait, what? What was with that aiming? Why did that one, like, come at me? Like, directly at me? Hey, seven hit combo. That's the most I'll, I'll probably ever get. That's another seven hit combo. Okay, why is this spot working so much better? The, the patterns are just working out better. I still don't know how I'm going to hit that head. Yeah, maybe it's just the positioning between these two heads that's, that's nice. Ugh, you see how close I have to be? Maybe it works better on the other side of the lake. I don't know. Also, its positioning is just weird. Oh god, I thought I was gonna hit it there. Great. One, two, three. It's still got four heads. Hey, there's another head down. Three heads, I should say. Who? 
getting me nervous because I know that last hit is going to be a real pain. I, I've got to land like the first star one or something on it, and I'd have to do that. Oh my god. A lot, to say the least. That first arm one just has such better range on it, you know, which is why I'd have to use it. We're getting there, though. That head's gotta be coming close. It's like each head should take, what, 66 hits? Maybe that's where I was pulling uh, the 7. No, that doesn't make sense still. Hello. Hey, there's another head down. We've got two left. Wait, two? Yeah, two left. One's just in the wall. Ah, oh, and this one's also really bad. As you can tell by the way that it jiggles so much. I don't know why they would have it moving so much. Also, it's got a wonky hitbox, as you can see. See? Look at that. It's silly. Like, ugh. maybe it's that they don't really want to get hit too high up the neck and that one's neck goes really far into the ground or something. But... I think that is what it is, by the way. Oh well, I got like three hits there, I think. Who? We're getting very close to having to deal with that last head. Good night. I'll see ya. Also, please. Yeah, I was gonna say, you shouldn't be stuck in that loop. I don't think I landed a single hit there, you know? Like, that's what's dumb. Why are you so far out? What the heck? Can standing over here help? Oh, wait, what? Did you see that? Is there a way I can stand up here and hit that head? Hmm. I don't think there is. Even if I, like, time it correctly. Man, it's not close enough. Whoa, that thing is really backed up, hadn't it? Yeah, it looks like it just doesn't have much of a hitbox on the middle part of its neck. Like, I don't know. It's weird. Come on, guys. I'm not that far away. Please. Yeah, four hits. That's not bad. Oh, he did his alternate. They did their alternate attack. That's good. I didn't see how the other head moved, though. And also this. Just this spit. There we go. <laughs> this is why I didn't want to fight the Hydra, by the way. It's these last two heads that really made me... Uh, They really made me worried about it, but... Oh, hey. That was a really good... Good attack, but... I squandered it. Really, it's this last head. That hasn't even... That I haven't even started on. It's that one that really worries me. Because it could be, like, hundreds of cycles before I actually pull off successful... Enough successful hits. 
It's weird because you gotta like run to one side and then run all the way to the other. It's very active to hit the last head, and that was with a weapon that had more range than this. Granted, it wasn't much more range, it was Painting Guardian Sword, but it was more range, so it's, it makes me worried, you know? I can't tell where the ledge is. Ugh. I also just wish that the water was easier to see through, so I knew what was safe. That would have been nice. Yeah, I don't even know if I can hit him here. I can. Once. There we go. That's a good one. These. You're so close. Oh my god. Look at how far I have to reposition myself so that that can actually, so I can actually hit it. Look at how dumb that is. The design of the Hydra really wasn't very smart. I mean, it makes sense until you get down to the last heads, in which case then it, the quality really drops off. Well, even still, it's not great because its attacks are really, it's got very few attacks. I mean, it's a mini boss, what do you expect? But at the same time, like, it's really hard to even approach at the start, you know? There's many things that could have been changed about it, is my point. Though I guess that goes for the whole game, really. You could have added scaling fist damage. <laughs> like, I don't know if it ever gets close enough for me to even hit it with my fist. I'll keep trying for a bit after I knock off this head, so I'm not just going to give up as soon as I... But it, it worries me that I might have just wasted a lot of time. And... Oh god, yeah, yeah, like, that's as close as I could get, I think. At least without giving myself a heart attack every time I go for it, you know? Which I'd rather not do. Please do your other attack. Uh, no, you, maybe you did, actually. Hey, so we're down to the last head. Oh, joy. What? You should definitely get a clip of that. What do you mean it has a plunging attack? That makes no sense. She wait, do shields get plunging attacks? When you say crystal shield, do you mean crystal shield or crystal ring shield? Those are very different. I can get really close over here, actually. Oh god. Like, I don't think this is possible. At least not without giving me a heart attack, as I said. Right, that's what I was thinking. Because, like, the, uh, crystal shield already has a plunging attack, you know? So I would assume it's actually for the crystal shield. All right, it doesn't have a plan. Sorry, it has an R2. It has a shield bash. How close can we get over on this side? This feels really close. I don't think it's close enough, but... Wait, is it? Oh my god. What the... Oh no. Oh god. Oh, wait. Guys. Do you see this? Hmm. This is going to be interesting. Is there a way I can bait out that other attack? No, I guess this is the bad one. But hey. You can bait out the good one. Hey, there it is. Or you can actually hit him here. Never mind, guys. I have solved the head problem. Unless they reposition on me like that, but... Like, I could technically reach that. There you go, look at that. And then he just... 
Ooh, how did I whiff so many, though? Whatever. He's done it, though. He has figured it out. Oh my god. This is actually good to know for the future. That you can actually pretty easily... You just kind of stand right here. Oh god, that scared me. Yeah, when their mouth actually opens, that means they're doing the, uh, the good one. Ah. Uh, if they chain it, it looks like their positioning gets all wonky. Please don't shove me off the edge when you're coming back, though. So when you... So does it get an animation as well for, like, stabbing them in the face? Like, if you drop on a demon? Like, Taurus demon, for example? I guess... Probably can't. Whoa! What? Okay, question then. What about the spiked shield? I think I need to be a bit closer, by the way. Yeah, it looks like it's... I would think actually plunging attack, if only for the fact that it's doing that much damage. Ah, I missed. Oh, god! I was just... As I said, gave myself a heart attack. As I wish not to do. I want to come back over here where, like... I can't see right now, guys. Stop. There we go, I want to come back. What are you talking about? Why? I could almost just punch one of the normal body parts, like one of the actual necks that's been cut off. It's so close. Okay, so yeah, that's really cool by the way, that it has a... Uh, yeah, why does it spew yellow mist? Ew. I've never noticed that it does that either. Does it normally do that? back over here. Turn back this way. I don't think I've ever noticed that it does that. Maybe you're not normally close enough. Wow, that one was like actually centered on me. That one, how does, this head isn't supposed to aim, it's just supposed to go off in a random direction like that. <laughs> right, exactly. I, I'm thinking maybe you're not actually normally close enough to see the yellow mist if anything. Like, maybe if you're on the other side of the lake, it doesn't actually appear, if that makes sense. I'm actually gonna... Nah, I'm not gonna chase it down. I was going to, but... Like, look at how close this spot is to the Hydra. That's crazy. I'm actually gonna wait for it to turn a bit closer. Hey, look at that. It's actually, like, zeroed in on me. <sighs> Don't push me, though. You know, that could be it. That could definitely be it. Whoever fights the Hydra on this side anyways, you know? I would think Hydra blood, but then when you cut off a head it spews out. Doesn't it spew out red blood whenever you cut off a head? Doesn't it actually spew red blood when you cut off a head? Now that I think about it, I don't know. Alright, it spews out red blood now, but... Other bottle- yeah, right. Ew. This is not actually just made of water, this lake, but whatever. It's got a few other things in it. We've got to be getting close, right? Look at how close it is. 
Like, when does it ever get this close to the- oh god, to the land, you know? Ah, it shoved me. I only got like three hits off. I'm just gonna attack over there again. No, turn back this way. You think, like, it's dead next attack site? It could be. Eh, nah. It's close, but not quite close enough. I don't want to go over that way because this is where the land juts out the farthest. Ugh, I hate that I'm landing like three hits because it's shaking its head so much. I'm just really happy that I I was ac that I'm actually able to kill the Hydra with my fist, which I was thinking wouldn't really be possible. I'm glad I actually decided to try coming over here. It's got to be close. Come on. How? And then I'll probably kill the Crystal Golem and then call the stream there, because I've done a ton today already. Like, this is made- I have made so much- Hey, there we go. It was really close, yeah.